In this problem, you're being given uh, information about an election. Uh, you're told that 2.8 million votes were cast and that 28,000 uh, more votes were cast for candidate one than, from ca than for candidate two. And you're being asked to determine what percentage of the votes were cast for candidate one. Uh, now, this problem is um, an algebra problem. It does involve some percentages, but really, if you can uh, set up the uh, algebraic formula, the actual math is pretty straightforward. Uh, the numbers are a little complex. I actually wrote some numbers down myself just to make this go along a little bit quicker. But you'll have a calculator on the test, so you'll be able to do the uh, mathematics uh, quite simply. Uh, so let's, uh, let's start with the information. 2.8 million votes were cast, 28,000 uh, more were cast for candidate one than candidate two. So um, we know that the total is going to be equal to 2.8 million, which is 2,800. Zero. Um, now, if we assume that uh, candidate two had um, X votes, then candidate one would have X plus 28,000. And I know that's a little bit tricky, but that's, that's what's going on here. Um, can candidate 2 received X votes, candidate 1 received X plus 28,000, and the total is equal to 2,800,000. Now we just solve for X. Uh, 2X plus 28,000 equals 2,800,000. Um, so 2x equals 2,800,000 minus 28,000, which is equal to 2,770,000. Incidentally, I didn't do that uh, in my head. I, calc you know, I calculated that number in advance, just so you know. Um, and therefore, x is going to be equal to 2,772,000 divided by 2, which is equal to 1,000,000. 386,000. Okay? And again, I calculated that with a calculator earlier. Um, so, now in order to determine the percentage, what we have to do is we, uh, we want candidate 1. So candidate 1 was x plus 28,000. So we're going to take the 1,386,000, which is the value of x, plus the 28,000 extra that candidate 1 got. And then we're going to determine what fraction of that is the total number of votes. So that's this number over the total number of votes, which is 2,800,000, uh, which again, if you do the math, and again, you can use a calculator to determine this, uh, you get 1,414,000 over 2 million. Uh, 800,000. And again, if you plug this into a calculator, what you will get is 0 0.505. But again, this is just the, f the uh, decimal fraction that this equates to. If you want to convert this to a percentage, you have to multiply by 100. So we take this, we multiply by 100, and what we are left with is 
So the answer is 50.5%.